side missions. <laughs> that is what we are doing today because you guys overwhelmingly responded that yes. If we're gonna be playing through Mass Effect, we might as well do some side missions. So hey, YouTube Basics, welcome back to the channel. Or welcome to the channel if you're new here. Hello, I'm Basic with Girl, and this is my first playthrough of Mass Effect. We left off with debriefing that we still need to do because after two and a half hours of recording and wrapping up everything on Pharos, I still had not, I, I just, I didn't want to spend another 30 minutes talking to my crew. I was tired. It was late. And I'm sorry. So we're gonna start today's episode by going and chatting to the rest of the crew and then we're gonna pop into some side missions. If you've not done so already, hey, make sure that you hit the subscribe button, turn on your bell notifications and all that jazz so that you get alerted when new videos go up here on YouTube. Feel free to check me out on other social medias. I'm Basic Wit Girl everywhere. Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, and Twitch. I stream four days a week on audition to like the, the the stuff that we do here. We do live content over there. That's my spiel though. Resume. Debriefing time. I already talked to my boyfriend because of course I was gonna do that. Of course I was gonna do that. Alrighty. Garrus and Rex and Ashley and old Alliance requisition officer. I don't, I think he's just for buying stuff from Garrus, hi. Commander, I, what can I do for you? What's the matter? You sound troubled, Garrus. Mr. Vicarian, is everything all right? Something bothering you? It's Saren. I'm starting to wonder whether we'll ever find him. He's always one step ahead of us and he's got those damn geth. Hey, do you think he'll get away? Under my command? We're getting close, Garrus. We'll find him. I wish I had your confidence. I just can't stand the thought of him getting away with everything he's done. I know you're doing everything you can, and if anyone can catch him, it's you. But if there's anything else I can do to help, anything, just tell me what you want me to do, and I'll do it. Hey. He's so confident in my abilities. You know, it really feels nice to hear that. After getting chewed out by the council after every mission, it's nice that my crew here believes in me. Honestly, screw the council. As long as squad squad believe bless up, uh, as long as they have faith in me, then like I'm not worried. Are you wor are you worried? I understand your concern, but we will find him. Just make sure you're ready to go when we do. Yes, ma'am. You can count on me. All right. Thanks for hearing me out. I appreciate. it. Absolutely. Can I ask you something, Commander? Of course you can. Of course you can, Garrus. What is it? Are you worried that the Council might be protecting Sarah? I mean, they were really dragging their heels before. What if we find him, bring him back to the Citadel, and they refuse to act? That is an excellent point. <gasps> oh! Garrus, I did not even think of such possibilities. Ooh, what are you saying? You know, elaborate on it, but like, I love a good conspiracy theory. What are you saying? I get the feeling this isn't a question. Speak your mind, Garrus. Well, you're among we friends. Give them the chance, Commander. In my opinion, Saren's too dangerous to be kept alive. Too much could happen. He could escape, or the Council might let him go. If we find him, when we find him, I say we make sure we stop him permanently. Yes, I agreed. I am so with you. We'll see. <laughs> agreed. Last resort. Cut my life into pieces. This is not my last resort. I am kind of with you, Garrus. I'm kind of with you. I mean, we don't have to tell anybody this stuff, but you want to keep this between us? I'm very down to like keep this our little, you know, secret covert plan of action. I'm, uh, agreed. I'm glad you see it that way. I never had any intention of capturing that bastard. When I see him, he dies. Good. The council won't like it, but they can't stop you. <laughs> Bruh, the council see, doesn't like me anyways. Respect. You never have to worry about bureaucratic idiots making a mess of everything. Okay, well... Sure. However, this is why I want to be a specter. So that I can murder at will. 
When I see fit. But for justice and for good reason. Yeah, Garrus. Uh, okay. Don't let me down. <laughs> okay. Just make sure you're ready when it happens. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. All right. I need to take him out on some more missions. Ashley! You want to talk about your weird sister and her swords again? Commander. Hey, can we talk? How are we doing? What's your opinion of the last mission? Gotta admire those colonials. That's about the worst place for a colony I've ever seen. Given the option, I'd get the hell out of Dodge. Oh, okay. Can we talk? Do you have a few minutes to talk? One on one? I'm off duty until tomorrow. I was gonna have a small drink. Bit of a celebration. If you're interested. Yes. Bestie, let's take tequila shots. Please. Okay, what's the occasion? What's the occasion? It's Armistice Day, when the first contact war ended. My family always marks it. Since I'm the only Williams aboard, I thought I'd ask you. I'm flattered. Seems like an odd thing to celebrate. Oh, I... That was 26 years ago. Oh, no. In our family, it's not really a celebration, more like an obligation. I'm so sorry, I meant to say I'm don't flattered. tell me you don't know about my family. My commanders always find out. It's not in my files or something? And your files were clean? There's almost nothing in your files. Technical scores and a list of crap assignments. There's a reason for the crap assignments. I'm General Williams' granddaughter, the commander of the Shanxi garrison in the war. The only human ever to surrender to an alien race uh, that's not your fault, though. It's not your fault what your grandfather did. <laughs> Ashley, Ashley. Don't tell me you're blamed for that. Not formally. Dad got passed for promotion over and over. And I think my record merits more than garrison duty in a backwater agri colony. It takes a special kind of big headed to march into a job where your family's blacklisted. I did it anyway. I'm not gonna let our name go down with Arnold and Quisling. Granddad deserved better than that. Oh, man. And that's why you dislike the aliens. <sighs> okay, I'm starting to see and understand, I guess, Ashley a little more. She's very anti-alien, but I guess, like, if the eyes of the entire universe are on her, I guess she has to appear, at least, to, like, really, like, ugh, other races. You know what I mean? I don't like it. Investigate. Okay, grandfather. What happened to your grandfather after the war? He was relieved of command as soon as I don't as like Shang it, but like I liberated. kind of have a better they understanding. Brought him back to Earth in irons, but there was never a trial. They quietly demoted him and stuck him behind a desk. He retired a year later and spent the rest of his life working construction in the colonies. Sometimes we hear about attempts to get him exonerated in some official way. Nothing ever comes of him. Okay. And then, uh, San As I recall, your grandfather held out for a long time. The Turians wrecked the orbitals in the first wave and occupied the major cities. They sat in orbit, dropping rocks on anything that moved. Granddad dispersed the troops. But when they went into the cities for supplies, the Turians would wreck a block to eliminate one fire team. Civilians were dying, his troops were starving, and he couldn't contact Alliance High Command. So he surrendered the garrison. Gotcha. All right, well... You deserve better. He refused to sacrifice his men just to save face for humanity. You planning to throw yourself on a sword to save face for him? Would it make a difference? He's gone now. Dad's gone too. And who would it impress? I'll never be good enough for the Alliance. So now you know. Gonna kick me off the ship, Skipper? Of course not. We need you. You're a valuable part of my crew, Williams. If I want an opinion from the head, I go to Alenko. When I want one from the heart, I go to you. I also play a mean game of pool. But anyway, let's go to a dive bar. I've got things to do before we land. I'm sure you do too. No, 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 no. Do you have a few minutes to talk? When do we go have drinks? My duty, Skipper. Rifles don't maintain themselves. Not yet, anyway. Did I miss the opportunity to get a drink? Oh, I would like to have a drink. Let's put on Nickelback and take tequila shots. Ashley, please. Dismissed. Ugh, okay. Ma'am. Dismissed. Dismissed. Rex! Uh, hey there, buddy. What do you want, Shepard? Um, I am just here to 
Chat, what can you tell me about the genophage? Ask the Salarians if you want details. They made it. All I know, it makes breeding nearly impossible. Thousands die in stillbirth, and most never get that far. Every Krogan is infected, every one, and no one's rushing to find a cure. Okay, let's elaborate on that. That's horrifying. Why don't the Krogan try to find a cure? When was the last time you saw a Krogan scientist? You ask a Krogan, would he rather find a cure for the genophage or fight for credits? He'll choose fighting every time. It's just who we are, Shepard. I can't change that. Nobody can. Oh, that's so sad. All right, well, let's talk about extinction then. Really, uh, continue to bring the mood are you down. Are really dying? We're sure not getting really... any stronger. We're too spread out. None of us are interested in staying in our own system. Okay, so lots of species have left their homes and prospered. But they go to colonize new worlds. We're not settlers. We're warriors. It's we like want they can't to really colonize either. So we leave. Hire ourselves out. And most of us never go back. Dang. I see. Investigate? Uh, I so see. Long, Rex. Oh! Shepard. Man, I, we, oh, we just really have not gotten an opportunity to learn more about Rex other than these terribly sad little insights into the Krogan race. Okay, let's see. Dolly! Shepard, Good job. I'm glad you're here. Great job with the mission. You seem happy. Glad you're feeling better. Good to see you smiling again, so to speak. You sound like you're smiling. I'm sleeping much better now. I guess I'm getting used to how quiet your ship is. Bestie is using the tart cherry mocktail. Things, I know Sterans are top priority, but with all the worlds we go to, I was hoping to find something to bring back to the flotilla. What are you thinking? What are you hoping to find? Usually people bring back something like a derelict ship we can use for salvage, but I need something bigger. There's a lot expected of me. Okay. I'm just gonna voice it. I'm just gonna voice it. She wants something bigger than a derelict ship and just happens to be a passenger on this like state of the art. Ship Tally, please don't do anything to the Normandy. I trusted you. Don't make the alien haters correct. I am asking so politely. I will vent you into space so quickly. I know that you weren't there to see what I did to the Rachni. Okay, but word should have gotten back to you. And I am not someone to be trifled with. Uh, why? What's so special about you? It's my father. He's the senior member of the Admiralty Board. He's one of only five people who can overrule the decisions of the Conclave for the good of the migrant fleet. Okay. My father is responsible for the lives of 17 million people. Our entire race is in his hands, and I'm his only child. Oh my god, so you're royalty. So are you some kind of heir to the Quarian throne or something? No, it doesn't work that way. My father's position isn't hereditary. I'll probably never serve on the Admiralty Board myself. Officially, I'm just the same as any other citizen, but it doesn't work that way in practice. People have always treated me differently because of who my father is. Hmm, like preference. Man, that's like being the kid's kid, like the, the coach's kid, or like the pastor's kid. Ugh. That is a lot of pressure, Tally. I am so sorry. You must get all kinds of special privileges. Probably my the opposite. Father had it easier than most growing up, but it's not all good. People like my father have enemies, and they're not above using me to get to him. Oh, well, I had no idea. Why didn't you tell me this before? I guess I'm just tired of people judging me because of who my father is. Everyone's That's waiting fair. for me to do something great on my pilgrimage. Something that will forever change our lives for the better. If I don't, it's like I failed. 
And that reflects badly on both me and my father. Man, that is not fair to you. All right, what if we save the galaxy? The work you're doing here is more important than anything any Quarian's ever done before. Yes, I know. But you have to understand Quarian culture. We're a very insular society. The events beyond the flotilla don't much matter to the average citizen. Our greatest dream is that one day, we'll return to our homeworld and drive out the Geth. But even if we stop Saren, that's not going to happen. There's still millions of Geth behind the Veil. Until they're gone, our exile will continue. Okay. What would you need to bring back to make everyone happy? Something that would help us better understand the Geth. They've changed significantly since the exile. They've continued to evolve. We've done our best to study them, but it's not easy. They're very reclusive. Until recently, they never went beyond the borders of the Vale. And all the Geth we run into now are under Saren's control. We'd need to find Geth operating on their own, independently. But I don't want this to get in the way of our mission, Shepard. First, we stop Saren. Then I'll worry about my own problems. All right. Oh my god, Talis, let's what talk about your dad. Like? <laughs> it wasn't easy growing up as the daughter of one of the Admiralty. Even before he joined the board, he was a prominent figure. People looked to him for leadership. He had to set an example, and he expected the same of his daughter. Plus, he was pretty strict, a military man through and through. Mm. He never allowed me to settle for anything less than excellence. As a kid, I sometimes felt like he was pushing me too hard. But now, I'm old enough to appreciate what he taught me. The world doesn't owe us anything. If we want something in life, we have to earn it. Okay. Uh, what about you, your mother? Were you close to your dad? Well, let's hope we get both of this. this. Mother was around, but she always seemed to kind of blend into the background. Almost like she was overshadowed by my father. He tends to do that to people. She passed on about five years ago. Oh, some man. airborne virus that swept through the fleet. Mm. Happens sometimes when the filters start to break down. I think my mm. father took it pretty hard. After she was gone, he became even more focused on his work. I think that was his way of dealing with the grief. Okay. Were you close with him? Sounds like a tough upbringing. You it's don't resent dead your father. parents. I think this was like a Disney said, movie. There's so many easy. dead parents in my this uh, story so far. The person you bond with. And he wasn't around all that much. Too busy. People counted on him, and he took his duties seriously. Even when he was around, he always seemed a bit distant. Like his mind was always somewhere else. Come to think of it, I can't ever remember seeing him smile. Not once. It's like he was always weighed down by all that responsibility. I mean, I know he cares about me, but he never really showed it. Not in the usual way. I guess the best thing I can say about my father is that I respect him. All right. That is very different. Respect is very different than like, I love him or he is my dad and we are pals. Okay. Talk about something else. Like what? Um, let's see. Have we already oh, done all these? I, guess. I doubt I can tell you anything you don't already know. It's been almost three centuries since they drove my people into exile. I think I've done all this. All I know is the story of their origins. What they were when we created them. Yeah, and I think how we've done this. I think we've done all of oh, those already. Like what? Uh, bye. I should go. See you later. See you later, indeed. Uh, Engineer Adams? Something I can do for you, Commander. I think we've already talked stealth personal questions in Normandy. Carry Goodbye. On, Adams. Aye, aye, Commander. Okay. I think that that, uh, that's that. I think that's it. We talked to Liara. She was in the in the doctor, and we talked to Caden. And I don't think Joker had anything new to say. Hello again, Caden. Though you're just so cute. Hey. <laughs> hey. Anything you need, Commander? Oh. I think we've already done all these Just things. Just trying to get a sense of I've wasted brief. enough of your time for now, Commander. We'll have time for personal debriefings later. We'll talk later, Caden. I'd like that. Ooh, I'd like that too. Let's talk more now. All right. Journal. 
let's see. Rogue, let's go and do this. We need to go to the soul system and the local cluster and deal with the rogue VI on Earth's moon. Okay. Soul. Soul cluster. I guess it's this. Local cluster? I think that's what it said. Soul. Yep, there we go. Travel to another system. Yes. Let's go. Looking for Earth's moon. Uranus. Neptune. There's Earth. Jupiter. Oh, Pluto. Oh, rip Pluto. Uranus, Mars, Venus, Mercury, Earth. Jupiter, Neptune, Saturn. I mean... I saw it there. Oh, it's there. Oh, it's a teeny. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, I see it though. Luna. That's gotta be it. Land. Let's go. I need to go get my eyes checked. <laughs> okay. Squad, squad. Who should we take with us? A. And then. Honestly, maybe Ashley. She likes Earth. <laughs> Or Garrus, because if it's, it's if we're taking out rogue squads, I mean, I don't want to bench Bay, but in Garrus, what does that look like? Lots of combat. Should I put them in the same room just to see how they react? And she <laughs> doesn't really like Durians. Make them sit in the corner and hug together. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. I, 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 the, uh, put your feet up, my darling. Baby boy, Caden Alenko, have the afternoon to yourself. Put your feet up, play some video games, maybe read a book, indulge in a little bubble bath if you feel so inclined. I am going to take these two out just to see what the dialogue looks like. <laughs> Let's go. Confirm. All right. Okay. All right, let's look at the map. We are here, debris, and okay, so we gotta just like head straight, I guess. Debris. I see it. I see the debris. Right there. Okay, let's come on squad let's maybe check this out or maybe this is not debris maybe this is just a rock this might just be a problem this is this is just that's my bad that's that's my bad y'all ready ready <laughs> just lead the way okay great sorry sorry that was just a test I was just testing the team squad squad's response time. Get into the vehicle. Okay, so over here is where we actually need to go. Whoopsies, whoopsies. Okay. Run, 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 run. Electronic skill too low. Ashley, you've got so many. Auto level up. Okay. Garrus. How about now? How about now? Oh, still too low. Dang. I still have 11 for myself. Does it say? It does. Okay, so it will like actually say electronics. So I do not have electronics. I have barrier. Boost shields. Should I just... Okay. Master shield boost. Advanced shield boost. Okay. Advanced carnage. Okay, okay, okay. Dude, I guess I could do throw. Unlock lift. Alright. And... Mayhaps... There we go. Can I undo your talent points? I cannot, I guess. Okay, whatever. It's fine. I didn't want that scrap anyways. I didn't even want it. I was just trying to help 
clean up the moon, you know. A green initiative. Doing what I can. Reduce, reuse, recycle. But whatever. You're telling me my electronics are too low to pick up garbage. Who am I to argue? Um. Woo! Getting some good air. Oh, I am going the wrong way. I need to go. I need to take a. Take a right. How do I. Wow! The moon. We're on the moon. Earth. I should we get some bumper stickers or something for the Mako? I think, like, that would be really fun. But, like, just like a. Please let me over. I'll cry. Or, like, a. <laughs> You know, what if we could get one of those little stick figure fams, but it's all of our little crew. Couple humans, Turian, Krogan. Oh, oh, all right, man, you're really putting this thing to the test. Oh, look at that. Uh-oh, I see a little bit of red though uh oh oh gosh oh they're like shooting right back at me huh uh oh oh boy oh jeez. oh all right soldiers get ready get ready get ready something is not right here oh god Eww. let me just break these turrets sorry earth <laughs> sorry earth you can build the alliance but something uh seems amiss here you know Dodge, duck, dip, dive, and dodge, baby. Okay. Woo! That zoomed right past me. Kerbalam. Okay. You cannot exit the main. Okay. Please. Let me park right here. There we go. I enter the building, huh? Oh, yeah, let me in. Okay, everybody be prepared. You guys getting along? Seems like it. There's not a lot of chatter going on. You guys good, though? Do you need your get-along shirt? Size XXL, little guild and cotton t-shirt. I'm here if you need me. Okay. Say the word. All right. The word is... Follow my lead. Be ready, everyone, please. Oh, wait. Actually, the word is, um, let's look at our equipment. <laughs> Ashley. Ashley. Take, take that. Uh, shotgun. You can take that. Can you wear medium armor? I, would think, I wonder if Garrus can. He might be able to. You. You can wear heavy. All right, heavy armor. Okay, Garrus, you can wear medium. Sick. You take that. That. Grab that. Okay. I don't think you're gonna need that, but like, if you do, take that, and then you got new armor. Okay, sick. Um, we'll do those things later. <laughs> I just want to be ready. Hello. Commander Shepard. Spectre. Ooh, hold on. Average decryption. Um. Perfect. Okay, take all. Oh, do you, you guys want to help? Uh, forward! Go, go, go! Team! Soldiers! Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit, I died. Oh! Oh, this is so far back! Oh, speed run 80%. Again, catching some real insane air. I would not do well with this. I. I'm not a road trip, car trip kind of person. I get very 
car sick if I am in a car too long and there's like road conditions. One time I took a family trip to Arkansas and just zooming around the, the Ozarks. Oh my God, am I going? Yeah, it's like there. Just zooming around like those little mountains, hills, whatever. Violently ill. Violently ill. This would be my actual nightmare. I would need a barf bag and to know where the exits are. Can't be good for the suspension either. I know these things are made for this kind of uh, ear. Okay, can you not? Still shooting. Still shooting. Can I? Can we flip back over or like. I'll just do it from here. This is. This is fine. We're gonna we're gonna get out of this. We're gonna fix it. We're gonna fix it. Garrus and Ashley, please hold on. All right, I'm gonna figure this out. <sighs> okay, we've done. We've done. Where am I? Oh, I'm over there. I need to. I'm in the incorrect area. Ah, there we go. There it is. I'm resisting the urge to be singing Creed again because a lot of people comments last time were like, oh, basic. Now I have Creed stuck in my head and while like, you're welcome. I can see how, you know, I may not be how everybody wants to spend their Thursday afternoon. Kerbalam, kerbalam. last one yes okay all right all right all right all right all right everybody out we're parked we're parked okay am i gonna save yeah i'm gonna save as soon as we get inside and i give everybody their stuff again open up the safe first of all garris <laughs> you're going advanced first aid now electronics yeah go there and now there we go. Skip. Uh, Ashley, auto level up. Basic Shepherd, you. We wanted a charm. We wanted some throw. What do we say? Advanced carnage seems tasty. Assault training. Lift. Barrier. Got two left. Where should we put it? Go there. I probably should have gone tactical armor. But now I can equip medium, which is nice. Medium armor, human. Yo! Ashley, you can put on your heavy now. And then actually, basic, can you take that, that, this one? Transfer installed upgrades to the new item. Yeah, that's sick. That looks so good. Listen, listen. I know we're trying not to be too renegade-y. But I think it's a nice reminder of what I'm capable of. Bloody delicious. Okay, Ashley, now you've got your heavy on. Garrus, if you could please take um, Uterian medium armor. Take that. 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 Okay. Now, save. There we go. No save. Yoink. All right, everybody. Get out your nice new things. Also, before I forget, uh, power usage. We want to go with, I think, all 
We want to turn that on so that then our squad squad uses their powers on their own. And I don't have to micromanage that. Blessed be. Okay, she's done it. Um. Oopsies. There go. Okay. Where, where's the thing that was trying to fight me last time? <laughs> oh my goodness. Holy cow. Holy cow. Okay. Wow. Oh my god, it blinded me. Actually, that is the wall. Oh my god, it keeps blinding me. Oh. Good to go. Negative okay. contacts. Did you guys get him? Did they die? I guess that they did. I want to look really quickly. Sorry, sorry. Hold on again. My apologies. With my assault rifle, I have. What do we have equipped? Polonium rounds. Radioactive polonium with every shot. Effectively poisoning. Okay. Are these, though. Should I go with, like, incendiary or something like that instead? Part of me thinks that I should. Because I don't think these little the uh, things can be poisoned. Something tells me that I can't just poison. What does this? Okay. That's... Conduits. There's nothing I can really do with that thing. You guys got any ideas? Just lead the way. Ready. Okay. I don't think that this is. Toxic gas is being vented into the bunkers. That's not good. Think we're good, Commander. I don't know if we are good, actually. But we're gonna. Okay. okay, so that's what we that's this is the move. We're just gonna vent all of the toxic air into the bunkers. All right, what's going on here? Check my journal. Take out those hostiles. What hostiles? Okay, hold on one second. I just let's see engage the ideal of the rogue. Okay, destroy the conduits destroy. Oh Okay It's literally just destroying these conduits. Okay Do you guys want to help feel free to get in here it feels pretty good Lights on the obstacle mainframe flicker and dies. The first of three computing clusters containing the VI is offline. Okay. Okay! All, All right. Down. All targets down. Fantastic. I guess that's really all we gotta do. Okay. Let's just do that. Area secure. 
I mean, there's a lot more. <laughs> the area is not like totally secure. Where are we at right now? Oh, we still have way more conduits. Uh, core cluster. I wonder if this is like, um, I guess we've done this. I guess maybe each of those. I bet no what it is. Do. What do you mean no can do? It was an accident. I didn't mean to send you there anyways, but telling me no is so rude, Garris. Um, I guess we got to get out of this little space station. And then go to the others. That's my assumption. Go back to the old Mako since nothing else is popping up on my map. That's what we're gonna go with. Come on. Let's go. Come on, everybody. Get close to me. Okay, so we are there at this one, right? I bet that there's also yoink. Yeah. Yeah. I see that green light. Enter this building. All right. Take all. That's his power junction. I don't care. I'm taking them all out anyways. I'm taking them all out anyways. For blam. Okay, everybody, everyone look alive. There's hostiles, literally so many. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Garrus, you get in there as well. Garrus, you go there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yikes. Let's heal up really quick. I'm just gonna stay back here. Garrus! Garrus, get on the action! Garrus, you're supposed to be the soldier! Garrus, go get him! Hey, you, Garrus, go over there! Go right there, go right there, go right there, go right there, go over there, go right over there. I am taking such a beating. I'm taking such a beating. Okay, are there more? Perimeter but we... clear. Parameter clear. Okay, sick. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go, squad. Kinetic barrier field powering up throughout the complex. Okay. Oh. Powering up. Perimeter clear. I don't want to die. I'm so close to death. Take out this one. Let me just. All right. Okay. Come on, team. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Watch out. Ashley, what did I just say to you? I said, please watch out. Okay. Let's go, team. Saving the galaxy. Saving the moon. Okay. Let's get out of here. Then we got one more. I like this red suit a lot. It matches my red gun. Ooh! Oh! 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 Negative contact. Oh 
my god. What a pain. Oh. Something's in the way. Destination blocked. Destination's not blocked. Go get him, 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 go get him. Go ahead, squad. Go ahead. Get in there. Garrus is already dead! Oh, hold on, hold on. Two? Two means everybody can get up. Come on! Okay. Garrus died a second time. Get up, buddy. Come on. Let's go, let's go. That should be it. <laughs> the good news is that should be it. Additional security. <gasps> no. Oh my god. Okay, you guys stay. You guys stay there. Y'all just stay right there while I take out you guys are in charge of I mean defense. Okay, there's both defense. Oh boy. You might die again. You might die again, Karis. Oh shoot. Get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there. Oh, man. Okay! Oh, not okay. I'm trying to be okay. There we go. Okay, come on, team. That we should it, be it. I think that we got them as well. Ooh, close one. Man, they kicked my butt that first time, but... So we're starting to learn how to properly utilize like, our teammates, our items. Are telling people to go up and you know get in there, Garrus, get in there, Ashley. All right, burst of white noise over all frequencies nearly deafens you. <gasps> Your hard suit heads, heads up day display interprets into a series of O's and ones. They repeat again in blanketing clusters to the lights and the final cluster flicker and die. Oh, specialization class achieved. Okay, your specialization, specialization class will replace your base class and your talents on the squad screen. Talent ranks in your base class transfer over to your specialization class. Go to your squad to view the bonuses you gain with each rank in your specialization. Oh, shock trooper! Highly trained killing machine. Shock troopers excel in combat. I accept. All right. Well, at least we got that. That's pretty nice. Little boosty boost. Just out here saving Earth's moon. Uh, is that because you're a human shepherd? No. It's because the YouTube commenters told me that that was an important one to do. There you go. Return to the Normandy. Return to the Normandy. Oh, I probably could have gotten got that debris, but that's okay. Whatever. Kaden, how was your day off? How did you, how did you spend your free time? Did you maybe write some poetry or, I don't know, maybe do some push-ups? What were you, what were you getting up to? <laughs> do you have anything to say to me? <laughs> I've wasted enough of your time for now, Commander. We'll have time for personal debriefings later. We'll okay. Later, we'll talk later, like Kaden. I like that too. Okay. <laughs> okay, I guess we could just go pick another side mission to do. Assignments. 
Pharaohs. I, we could go back to Noveria. Actually, what's this? Valuable materials. Ooh. Missing Marines. You've encountered a... Oh. <gasps> oh my god! Ah! I'm in the air, dude! I think it's time for us to head back to that big icky dune worm. And take that out. Sparta in the Artemis Tau cluster. I'm feeling it. Is it this one? I think it was this one. Let's go. Okay. I mean, if we're fighting again, we can stick with the same squad we had, except... All right. Yeah, distress signal. We just gotta head straight ahead to that distress signal. All right. Yep. Oh, gross. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. I'm feeling better about this already. Hey, watch out for the worm. Watch out for the doom worm. Do we... oh. Thresher Ma, please no. All right, zoom this way. Okay, okay, okay. Where are you? We're already. I'm already feeling so much better about this. Yoinks! Jump! Jump! Burst blast, uh, brain blast. Where are you? 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 Pop up! Pop up! Pop up! Pop up! Show yourself! Show yourself, you coward! Yeah! Coward! Come back! Come back! Come back! Come back! You're kidding me. I don't even get to loot the body. Precious resources or anything like that. Hello. Oh, the Marines are all dead. Look at that. Deceased. Dead. Aligned soldiers. Looks like they were lured here by the distress beacon. Yikes. Deceased. Medical kit. Open. These okay. are Admiral Kahoku's men. <gasps> we need to tell him what happened here. Oh. Oh. Okay. Nothing else? Nothing, uh, nothing else? Alright. Alright, squad. Let's go, gang gang. Get into the maker. Oh, is there anything else? I mean, these are just debris. There's an anomaly, you know, over here. Maybe we should go check out that anomaly. I think I've already been over here, actually. I'm pretty sure that I have. Not that I'm uh, really thinking about it. I think that I already got this anomaly, but then we had died, and then I never actually came back and did it again. Maybe? Oh, is it... Oh, is it the... Did I just hit somebody? Hold on. Did I just... Hold on. What happened there? Um... Mummified Solarian. No, I did not recover this artifact. <gasps> oh my gosh. Perfect. Uh, Captain Mylon's identification. How it ended up here is impossible to know for sure. Okay, well. That's crazy. Get into the vehicle. Now. I got more points I could use. I want to get my intimidation up. I know that I'm supposed to only be picking one or the other. I know that I am. However, I just, I like there to be, you know, a, a multifacetedness about me. Let's see, let's see. Missing Marines. Now, where do we go? Speak to Kohoku. Uh, return to the Citadel Tower and inform the Admiral of their fate. Okay, we can go back to the Citadel. I do want to just, like, maybe go into that, like, that fun little. <laughs> Casino bar, whatever. The Citadel. Let's go. Who do we want to? Kaden. 
Um, and I guess Ashley knew him. She identified who the people were. So we're gonna, we'll take Ashley. She was like, interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Okay. To After years of poor economic performance, Exogeny has announced that its research colony on Pharos is finally returning a profit. Wow. New discoveries and a dedicated colonization effort have finally paid off for Exogeny. Exogeny's wow. stock rose sharply with the announcement, with investors pleased at this surprising news. Surprising. So surprising. Kaden, do you need better armor? You can't do any of the medium, I guess. Can I wear this one? Well, your shields aren't very good on that. Well, I mean, your shields are good on that. I mean... Put that on you, darling. She's right over here. Mm, yeah, he is. Hello, Rear Admiral. No, I'm waiting to speak with one of the Count... Commander Shepard, isn't it? My name is Admiral Kahoku. Is there something I can do for you? Hey. I wish we were meeting under better circumstances, my man. Uh, found your men, and they're all dead. You sent a recon team out into the Artemis Tau Cluster? Yes, that's right. They went missing a few days ago. I've been trying to find out what happened to them, but I keep getting the runaround from Alliance Brass. Do you know something about this, Commander? I'm so sorry. I've got bad news. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm not sure how to tell you this, Admiral. Your men were killed by a Thresher Maw. A Thresher Maw? That's not... My men wouldn't just stumble into a thresher nest. Not the entire unit. It was a trap. It was a trap. They were set up. Somebody lured them there with an Alliance distress beacon. Placed it perfectly so they'd land right beside the thresher nest. Damn it. I had a bad feeling about this ever since my team disappeared. Who would do such Alliance a thing? Alliance beacon uses bait. My unit wiped out. And nobody seems to know anything about it. Who Commander, would do such a thing? Now I need to do my part. The families of those Marines deserve to know why they died. Can I help? Can I help you with those phone calls? I am great with people, okay? I am, I am fantastic with delivering bad news to people. Anything you need from me? Not right now, Shepard, but I'll let you know as soon as I find something out. Okay. Fantastic. I'll let you know. Hello, little guy. I hope you're doing super well. Hope that one weirdo is not bothering you too much. Emily Wong, what are you doing here? What are you doing here, Commander Emily? Shepherd, could I have another word with you? Hello again, Commander. I've got a proposition for you. Since you helped me get information on the crime syndicate, I've gotten a lot more backing from my publishers. I'm investigating traffic controller conditions now, and I wondered if you could help. Uh, what kind of help? What do you want me to do? <laughs> no! I've heard rumors that the space traffic controllers are overworked to a dangerous degree. I can't get into the control room, but you could. If you planted a bug inside, I could crack the story. Investigate. <laughs> uh, importance of the story, danger of the bug, results of story, da it will go danger? This bug you want me to plant, could it interfere with traffic signals? Absolutely not. I made certain that the frequencies it uses won't interfere with anything. Okay. Uh, what's what the function? What will this bug allow you to pick up? Just audio and video. I'm not trying to tap into the traffic control system if that's what you're worried about. I just need to hear and see them in order to correlate their activity with traffic efficiency. Okay. What's Everyone important? knows space traffic controllers are overworked. How is this news? There's a difference between overworked and dangerous. Traffic at the Citadel has increased by 300% in the last century, but traffic controller resources haven't kept up. Hmm. We already have several last-minute wave-offs per week. <laughs> Do we have to wait for a full-blown disaster? Okay, and uh, results? If you crack this story, what's likely to happen? Ideally, there will be calls to improve working conditions by hiring more controllers and upgrading systems. The Council won't pay for improvements voluntarily. That's this fair. This will provide that pressure. You know, I hate sitting in traffic. Living in a, a big city, I absolutely understand the importance 
of a stress-free commute. Let's see. We'll see. I'll try. I can't promise anything, but I'll see what I can do. Give me the bug. All right, Emily. Give me that. Excellent. Just place it on a terminal with a good view of the area. Thanks again for your help. In the long run, this story is going to save lives. I believe it. Okay. Big place. I like I found them. It's very soothing. What are those cherry trees? A positive observation of Ashley. Very soothing. Hmm. I bet Caden loves those 12 hour soothing rain to help you sleep type videos. I bet he loves those. I guess this is my rapid transit. I can just do this. Hello, random Turian. Um, consort here. Financial wards access. Okay, let's go to the wards. I'm just gonna try to find my way to that fancy casino. I think that it was here. I think it was the wards. Gang, gang, keep up, please. Coming up in a report later today, Emily Wong investigates corruption on the Citadel and uncovers a full-blown crime syndicate. She is totally fine with just putting her legal first name, first and last name, out for all the crime syndicates to know that she's snooping around. Girl, that is how you get a hit put on you, let me just say. Uh-huh, yep. This is where to flux. Sorry, Caden. I know it might make your head hurt. I'm sorry, darling. Not really my kind of place, but there sure are some spectacular views here. Oh, yeah. Just careful. just pay attention to the view. Rita. Doran. Let's see. Sorry, I'm kind of busy right now. So, uh, what can I do for you? What were you discussing with the Volas? Who, Doran? Oh, uh, I was just asking him about my sister. See, she worked for Dorn before she left to... Ugh, sorry. I don't want to bore you with my problems. Just tell me! It's okay. I'm interested to hear what you have to say. I came here to eavesdrop and well, snoop. okay. My sister Jenna left here to go oh. work at Cora's den. Oh. She is. She's working as an informant for CSEC. You know, eavesdropping on the people there. If they find out what she's doing, they'll kill her. Yeah, they will. That is not Being good. Informant is a dangerous job. That's what I've been telling her. Well, I don't know. Sometimes I think she stays there just to spite me. Have you talked to CSEC? I mean, why would she... Why would the sister go talk to her sister's boss? That's a little bit unprovoked. Do you know who her contact is? I'd be is? mortified. No, it's all very secret. Last time I asked an officer, he told me to stay out of it for Jenna's safety. All right, I'll go talk to Maybe Jenna. Maybe I can help her understand just how dangerous Cora's Dan is. Would you? That'd be great. Just don't tell her I sent you. Don't worry, well, I, I will not. back to work before I get in trouble. <laughs> Thanks. You're welcome. Hello, Doran. Welcome to Flux. Name's Doran. What can I do for you? All right. Flux! Is this a casino? Among other things, yes. We've got some quasar stations, uh, if you're interested. What is that? Is that like poker? Is that like poker? You gotta know when to hold them and know when to fold them? No when to walk away, no when to run, read it and Jenna. What can you Jenna? tell me about the sisters working for you? Well, Jenna left to work at Cora's den. Now her sister Rita is all worried. This dude is so kind of quick to just spill all not of the tea to a random mind, person though. who's walked in the door for the first time. I'm not She's even a regular a at this one. point. If she wanted to come back, I'd take her in a second. The customers loved her. Okay. Are you the owner? Owner, cook, and bartender. I've even been known to dance a little when the mood strikes me. Hey! We've got some quasar stations. Uh, if you're interested. Goodbye. I am. I Enjoy am interested. In flux. Where is the quasar station? What is what is that? Kaden, do you like to play quasar? Is this like Gwent? What is what is Gwent? A little patron? Okay. High stakes quasar? Oh god, I don't, know. I don't know about high stakes. We have low stakes? What is quasar? Play. Oh my gosh. Okay, 20 credits to play. Closest to 20. Oh, so it's like blackjack, but on our own without other people at the table. Play quasar. 
We'll just let's see. We got five. Okay. Uh, add four to seven. Add one to eight. Eleven. Okay. We can go another eight. Fourteen. Okay. So now we should go with this one. Maybe four to seven. Seven will bust, but. Jackpot! Yes, play again. Ooh, baby. Okay, let's go another one to eight. Hit me. Nine. Another one to eight, please. Fourteen. A same strategy. Yay! I'm so good at this. Pay out. I'm not going to go with one. Pay out. Nineteen. Pretty good. Play again. Third time. Okay, another one to eight. You got no when to hold them. No when to fold them. No when to walk away. No when to run. I can go another one to eight. Ah! Hey! Pay out. I'm so good at this. I'm so good at this. Pay. Pay out. Okay, would you like to play again? Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Two. Ten. Twelve. Seventeen. <gasps> okay, so this one's tough. So we can't go here. We can't do this because four will make us bust. One to eight, though. We could just take it. Or we could, we could push it. No, we should just walk away. We should just walk away. We should just take our payout. Because we did one, two, or three. But then five, like, a, yeah, we should just pay out. It's not the best. We'll try again, though. Okay, 14. Okay, okay, okay. That's a, that's that's enough. We've made some serious money. Kaden, do you want to turn Ashley? Oh man, my sisters would love this place. Maybe when this is all over, I'll bring them here for a girls' night out. Oh, cute. Okay, Kaden. <laughs> Drinks and dancing down below, gambling up above. Good place to blow off some steam. Let's go dance. Let's go get a drink and dance. I won't tell anybody else on the ship. I won't tell them. This can just be like our little fun team bonding okay high stakes suspicious gambling machine somebody rigged this machine to funnel credits through the system Can you trace us sir <gasps> Ooh. trace a signal who did it who was it never been a real fan of crowds who who rigged it kaden fix did make it tell me who did it who did it this one was suspicious did you solve it? Should we go talk to what's his face about it? Boop do 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 bouncer, hello. Hey, good to see another human in here. Can we dance? Caden, do you wanna dance? Caden, do you wanna dance? Again, please, just once more, please. Coincidentally, this is how I would dance as well. Like, th Ashley, do you want to come dance? It's expensive to live here. Oh. <laughs> I'm having such a good time here. I don't even want to go. S okay, you're. Oh, can we make out? <laughs> Should I talk to this dude about his suspicious gambling Hello, machine? Again. Can I help you? Uh, no, I guess not. Nope. Just passing through. Um, Enjoy your time here at Flux. Too many lights, too much noise. Can we get back on the dance floor? My day is made. Side quests worth it? 
just for this. Let's go to, uh, let's go to Cora's. Let's go to Cora's Den. See if we can, what we can find there. I wonder if it shows up in my, oh yeah, signal tracking. There we go. Track the signal. Uh, coming from the wards access corridor. Oh, okay. So that's like, I mean, like here, welcome to the wards. Well, let's just like, you know, like while we're here, while we're like here, you know, access corridor. Prison Come on, let's, let's go confront somebody about their illegal gambling operation. I think this is the, uh, yeah, right? This here? <gasps> yeah. Signal. Who's doing it? Who's doing it? Who's doing it? Oh, let me beat somebody up. Oh, let me beat somebody up. Let me beat somebody up. Who do we got? Who's doing it? Hello. Signal source. Investigate. Looks like whoever it was bounced the signal off a hidden relay. I'll trust <gasps> the new Dang it! Okay, you're... Thank you. Thank you, Kaden. You're so valuable and important to the team. Follow the signal to the Presidium. Oh, dang! Okay, well, let's go to Rita's sister first. I'm overwhelmed with side quests. I just want to do them all. We'll definitely do another episode that's just like running around doing more side quests. I just don't want this to be over. Reporter Kalisa Algelani recently attempted uh -huh. to land an interview with Commander Shepard, the first human specter. Unfortunately, Shepard refused to answer questions, raising concerns regarding the specter's commitment to humanity. We'll have exclusive footage later today. Footage? Exclusive footage of what? We're trying to control the narrative, not wanting to hear me out. Being rude? Trying to make me seem like the bad guy? Absolutely not. I cannot believe we got to dance with Kaden. That was so cute. That was so cute. That was so cute. He's like, I don't like crowds. But he will absolutely, like, bust down on the dance floor. All right, give me the chores and chorus then. I, he makes an exception for that, I suppose. Um, excuse me, little sis. Is that Jenna? Jenna. Jenna! 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 Hey. I understand you're like in the middle of shift right now. Hi. I need to speak with you though. Hey. 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 Jenna. Oh, this is probably Jenna. This is Jenna. That's not Jenna. This is Jenna. Okay, I'll be with you in just a sec. Hey. Okay. Take your time. I'll wait right here. Why do I get the feeling you're not here to order drinks? I'll be quick. Because I'm not. I need to talk to you about your work with CSEC. I don't know what you're talking about. We're gonna get now, him killed with this kind of lingo. To get back to my customers. Hey, I'm trying to help. This isn't a game, Jenna. These people are dangerous. Now you sound like my sister. Why is everyone so concerned about me? I can take care of myself. Can you? I need to go. I'm not a stripper. I don't get paid to stand around and look pretty. Charming girl. <laughs> okay, well, we did what we could. You guys wanna get team lap dances? Who's Chellick? Let's see. Let me talk to this individual. Hi. Hey. Hey. If you've got questions about Jenna, meet me at CSEC Academy. Jenna? What did you just say? Push off. I never did nothing to you. Damn newcomers. Think they can run the place. What was that about? I guess we better go find out. Yeah, we better go find out. Journal. <gasps> Ominous music plays as journal updates. Okay. I guess we won't go get a lap dance. We better go see what's going on with Jenna. Go get some information. Ugh. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. Fast travel. Oh, Chelic. Oh, my God. Sneeze. Come into my office. Oh, no offense, Commander, but what the hell were you thinking? Uh, I'm sorry. What? I don't follow you. You could have blown Jenna's cover. We were there to help her. I gathered that. It might uh -oh. seem cold letting her take Ashley. all the risk. Or Ashley keeping getting, a close eye on her. I should get in spicy. Okay, is it worth it? Uh, I saw that. Is it worth it? Do you really need to risk her life to get the information you want? This job isn't easy and it's usually unpleasant. I'll take help anywhere I can find it. Okay. But since you were so concerned with her safety, maybe there's a way we can help each other. Always playing the angles, detective? As part of the job, 
Now, are you going to help me or not? Uh, let me. You're a smart guy, Chuck. Oh. Figure out another way. Oh. I do have several contingencies. She's just my option A. I'll cut her loose, even get her out of Cora's den, no strings attached. But, but. that's my case unsolved. I could still use your help. Okay. What do you need? Sure. What case do you have? I'll help you, but I need some details. I'm trying to track down an illegal arms producer. I just need some of their product. Thanks to Jenna's intel, I've learned there's a seller here on the Citadel. Meet our man named Jax. Pick up the mods and bring them back here. That'll give me everything I need. Okay. Uh, I could just ask him what makes them Why illegal? Why are you so concerned about these mods? We have access to some of the most sophisticated weaponry there is. It's what gives us our edge. What do you suppose happens when we lose that edge? These give criminals an advantage we can't afford to let them keep. Okay. I'll persuade Jax to tell me where these mods are coming from. No. Ah. You tip Jax off and all my leads will disappear faster than you can say bad bust. Where can I find this Jax? Oh, right. That's fine. Jax is down in the lower level of the markets. I'll send word through our channels that you're the buyer. Good luck, Commander. Okay. Paragon, plus two. I, I, I didn't mean to just click it that quickly, but yet here we are. Should I talk to these individuals? Hey there. Oh, you're not CSEC, are you? Did you want something? Uh, who are you? What are you doing here? I am Jaleed. I came here to seek aid from the authorities, but they won't listen to me. What happened, buddy? My colleague is trying to kill me. Oh. I thought we were friends. That's a very serious you claim. Know you're dead. He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and he started following me. <laughs> Yesterday, he followed me all the way home, just waiting for a chance. Are you sure he wants I to don't kill you? No one thinks. He wants me gone. I know it. Okay, what do you need? Is there something I can do? Uh, talk to your friend, maybe? Would you? That's all I want. Someone to talk to him. Tell him to leave me alone. He thinks he can just push me around, but you'll show him, won't you? Uh, sure. I'll talk to just him. Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. Oh, right. Oh, well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. This His is probably going to be something that's like Solarian. very innocent. You and shouldn't have sweet. any trouble. He's just a scientist. Well, good luck. Okay. All right. Honestly, we're going to call it here because once again, I have just let time get away from me. And this has been a longer. It just, you know, with these side missions. It's so easy to just one more, just one more, just one more. Especially when you're not getting a lot of like story development. You're not getting a lot of like interact. You're just trying to get through things and on to the next. We're going to call it here though. Uh, if you guys made it to the end of the video though, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't done so already, please make sure that you hit the subscribe button. Turn on your bell noties and all of that jazz. Um, let me know down below, I guess, what your favorite side missions are. Um, that you that played in Mass Effect 1. If there's any that you recommend me trying to do before we head on to the, the big finale. I think we're going to do at least a couple more kind of strictly side mission and interactions uh, before moving on to that. Just so, I, I don't know, I don't want to get locked out of everything. And it seems like that uh, Vermeer is kind of a, a big one. So let me know down below in the comments. Uh, feel free to join our Discord as well. Or follow along with me on all of my socials. That was a weird sentence, but you, you get the gist. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one. Have a good one. <laughs>